What's up, Dice Crew? Keeping it a Benji, and I'm getting back with y'all. Now, first off, shout out to the Dice Crew, and second, shout out to the sponsors, the Reup. I'm gonna have a link in the description so y'all can tune in with them. Now, moving forward to the topic, we got P Nice getting into it with ODM Slim, but it's more about um P Nice is also explaining and like chiming in with people about people saying that he making his hood look bad and stuff like that. So let's tune in. I'm going to keep it a Benji for y'all doing the reaction. Y'all keep it a Benji for me in the comments. Let's rock. And no, and no. You got a question for uh, P. Nice and no? Yeah, bro, I got a question here. Um, how you doing, bro? Um, P. Nice. Mm. I wanted to ask, but like, as y'all being like respected members, you know what I'm saying? Like, y'all don't think that's like stepping over the line, y'all putting the, the street the, with the content, you know what I'm saying? When y'all say that it's all just content. Yeah, so, so for me, the way I look at it is, as long as I'm not incriminating nobody or speaking on no ongoing cases and none of that type of shit, everything is a go. And you know, I I agree with P Nice on that. You know, what I would also add on is like for me myself is like I'm not finna speak on anything or bring anything to the internet that ain't already on the internet. You know what I'm saying? And that's one of the things that I always try to keep myself uh, held accountable to. You know, I don't want to just go go out there and fish or go out there and grab something that's going on in the streets and then bring the first be the first person to put bring it to the internet or something like that. Or neither am I like a person that's out here trying to expose people. You know, if it's out there, then I'm going to talk about it. If it ain't, I mean, you know, that's just the case. But in another light, with certain people, you know, I do understand what people be meaning when they feel like, well, the rule from the get-go is we not supposed to really be in on camera talking about nothing street-related anyway. You know, that's the original rules anyway. So I ain't gonna, you know, I'ma just keep it a Benji, even though I be doing what I be doing on here, I'ma keep it a Benji, you know what I mean? However, we still is in a different day, a different day in a different time. So some of the rules have sizzled out or kind of got watered down or, you know, the goalposts have been moved or whatever. But I would never sit here and not act like, you know, to a small degree, I'm not being wrong myself for being on here talking about street stuff anyway. You know, that's just something we really shouldn't even be doing. But I'm just keeping it a Benji. But let's continue. You know what I'm saying? Everything is a go. I'm not I'm not out here making my set look goofy, you feel me? I'm 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 in my set. You know what I'm saying? Everybody in my hood know what's happening with me. You feel me? They know I'm an entertainer. They know we, we have these discussions. That's what people don't understand. You feel me? Ain't nobody bigger than the program, you feel me? So when we do these things, you feel me? We be talking to the homies or the homies tapping like, yo, p nice, what's up with this? Or what's up with that? What's going on with that? Then you explain it to them. Okay, cool. All right, bet. We all on the same page where I'm at. You feel what I'm saying? So I'm not doing nothing. Like, so when people get to talking. And you know, I like something that he just said, right? When he said, like, explaining things, right? Because we live in a certain society to where people feel like they don't got to explain or they feel like that'll make them weak or be less than by explaining themselves. But for people that don't understand certain things, the only way that they can understand it is if you break it down and explain it. You know, it's not to make yourself to come off like you a strange person or a weak person or even for myself. It's just if a person sees something and they don't understand it and it's pertaining to them and what we all represent, you shouldn't be bigger than you shouldn't think you bigger than the program to where you ain't got to explain that. I mean, you know, definitely if it's to the right type of individuals, I ain't saying just put yourself out here to where you just going to be uh, letting a person think they could kind of like pick at you for whatever the reason it may be. But if you know a person really stand for what y'all all represent or what we all represent and they kind of don't understand what you're doing. You got to explain things so you can kind of lace people and give people the game. And I also feel like uh, like if, you know, enough people in your hood don't understand how you are, you can definitely have a problem even more. So I would also suggest that you kind of have some type of level of uh, a real background in your community before you kind of try to become uh, 
voice or a spokesman or internet or even maybe a rapper or whatever it may be that you call yourself to represent your uh your hood or whatever you a part of in a public life oh you making your hood look bad and you doing this you doing that no my hood love me my hood telling me keep going my hood telling me yeah man you putting us on a map bro like you keep on riding keep on oh and you know what i forgot to chime in on that but he also said that his hood knows that he's an entertainer and I respect that, too, for keeping that a Benji, like saying that he's here to entertain and he's doing certain things and stuff just to be an entertainer. Some people don't like to hear that word or have that title associated with them because everybody want to be so tough. But, you know, at the end of the day, if you really ain't trying to be an entertainer, then you might really be just a full blown Internet banger or something like that. Yo, shit, be nice. You feel what I'm saying? Mm hmm. Gotcha. That's a fact. How you put your hood on the map with this picture? Send it a white picture. How you put your hood on the map, nigga? That's a nurse, nigga. That's ODM Slim, be nice. Hey, ODM. Hey, hey, ODM. Shut up. Nice. Nigga, get the picture and all that. Nigga, be free. Make your hood look bad. Well, you know, I'm not familiar with this situation, Dice Crew, so y'all gotta let me know if, if ODM Slim is uh, talking about something that actually took place or if he's just making that up. But what I'm gathering, it sounds like ODM Slim said that uh, P. Nice sent his private parts picture to a white dude. That's what ODM said, right? Let's hear it again. Me. My hood telling me keep going. My hood telling me, yeah, man, you putting us on a map, bro. Like, you keep on riding, keep on doing your shit, P. Nice. You feel what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Gotcha. That's a fact. How you put your hood on the map with this picture? Send it a white picture. How you put your hood on the map, nigga? That's a nurse, nigga. That's ODM Slim, P. Nice. Hey, ODM. Hey, hey, ODM. Shut up. Nice. Nigga, get the pics and all that. You nigga, freaky. Make your hood look bad, nigga. Hey, hey, shut up, nigga. The fuck? Hey, shut up, nigga. What the fuck? Nice, nigga. I'll knock you out. That life. Yeah, right. Man, hey, 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 Come on, cuz. Hey, got a real ass pussy, nigga. Shut up. Hey, I eat pussy. You, pussy. you been eating pussy. You got a real pussy. I eat pussy. You suck dick, nigga. Nigga, nigga you been eating pussy. I eat pussy. You suck dick, nigga. Nigga, straight up. I eat pussy. You suck dick. Shut up. Freaky ass nigga talking about. Hey, what type of nigga talking about? Like it's a problem. I was hoping they could talk. They could hide. You know, y'all gotta let me know, Dice Crew, what all this is like even coming from. Um, I don't know why ODM Slim just chimed in like that and took the situation to where he took it. But I do remember we made a video with a reaction where ODM Slim pretty much was calling everybody up there at No Jumper Nice. You know what I mean? So, or maybe we didn't even put the video out. Maybe I just watched it or watched a clip or something like that. But let's continue. You from pussy eating niggas, niggas to ass eating niggas. niggas. That's the fuck oh, up. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Nigga, first is first party. Oh, yeah. Pussy niggas. Come on. Oh, yeah. Hey, 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 ODM. Hey, ODM. Hey, ODM. Hey, ODM. Good. Call me pussy hey, 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 where you at? Line it up. Line it up. Fuck. Where you at? Line it up. Fuck. Where you at? Line it up. Hey, you know, I'm kind of like, I'm wondering how do ODM Slim know what's all pertaining to a P-Nice background, you know? I mean, you know, when you're in these streets, you know, it's not hard to stumble across information about certain people. You know, a little bit of everybody know a little bit of everybody, but they definitely on like total two different sides of the map. You know, he over in the 50s, South Central, ODM Slim, uh, you know, Western and all that over there, Normandy and all that. 
Then you got Pete Nice and stuff way down in the uh, 21st Street, way on the east side of Long Beach. So, you know, I don't know. But maybe one day, P. I mean, uh, ODM Slim will break down some of those things that he really, I guess, privy to pertaining to Pete Nice being nice. Or maybe he's just talking. We, 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 just, we, chilling, we chilling, we chilling, ODM, we, we chilling. Running the whack, whack, whack. Hey, whack. Right. We you know him, whack, whack. I'm like, if like you could. Movie. They run to the park room, nigga. This nigga bad. This ain't real key ways. You talk a bad nigga. Niggas ain't real key ways, girl. Niggas is weirdo. Hey, ODM, ODM. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Uh, uh, I'm gonna meet, meet up, man. I'm gonna meet up. I was hoping, I was hoping we we could have. Obviously, y'all niggas can't talk, so we just gonna leave it at that. Uh. You said what, fool? You breaking up a little bit, Pete Nice. Can you hear me? Yeah, there you go. You, you're in the Matrix. You're in the Matrix. You're in the Matrix a little bit. You might be in the mountains. Where you at? You in the woods? Where you at? <laughs> Can you hear me? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're in the Matrix. You're in the Matrix, brother. Mute, mute your mic real quick and then unmute it. You there? Can you hear me? A little bit. Let me hear you. Yeah, there you are. There you are. There you are. Uh, we're we, we going to continue with the questions, man. Fan meets. Fan meets. Hey, 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 hey. That nigga bad. <laughs> uh, Lily Kate. This nigga burned the whole city, cuz. Damn. What's, What's the deal? Shout out.